Praise the Lord. Good morning. Real, real quick. Watch this. Let's say your husband is 56 and you're 51. That means that your husband learned right from wrong before you because he is older than you. Let's say your wife is 45 and you're 39. She's older than you. That means she learned right from wrong before you did. That means she reached puberty before you did. If your husband is older than you, that means he reached puberty before you did. And this is uh, an admonishment my mom and dad used to say to us all the time. You're the oldest. You learn right from wrong first. You know better. Let the beatings begin. <laughs> no, nah, I'm just playing. My mom and dad were very fair. Very fair. They will hold court. They will, have, they will hold a parental court. They would talk to us and decide whether or not if, uh, if corporal punishment was, you know, was, was to be meted out, if it was warranted, as I leave this alone. But you older than your wife, and look how childish you act. You older than your husband, look how you scream and yell and act. And I just want to just point that out because if you're older than your spouse, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your baby mom, your baby daddy, your ex-husband, your ex-wife, that means you learned right from wrong before they did. You grew up before they did. But again, many grow old. Many grow old and die. But many don't grow up. Deep message. You're older than your husband. You're older than your wife. You learn right from wrong. You learn the difference. You know the committal. You learn the, the sin aspect. You learn the punishment, the corporate punishment. You, you learned. You're older than that person. You learned before that person. I thought I'd point it out because many seem to fail to realize that. You're older than your spouse. You're older than your uh, wife. You're older than your husband. You're the oldest in the house. So you're supposed to set the example. It's no such thing as a queendom, but there's a such thing as a kingdom, and there is such thing as a dumb king. Peace. One.